Welcome back everyone to my Synthetic Dawn Stellaris Let's Play. At the current point in the Let's Play, I believe I am rapidly approaching a domination victory. In fact, I think I might be able to do it within a few videos, uh, depending on if certain things go correctly. I currently have 59 planets and I need 87 planets at the time being to achieve a domination victory. That amount may go up a tiny bit. It's basically 40% of all of the colonized planets within the map, within the galaxy. I'm currently at war with the Slough's Cox Empire, which is this massive empire down here. And I've been at war for about two videos, two and a bit videos. They were once arguably the biggest, strongest empire within the game. They've got 40 odd planets. I'm going to be able to take 15 plants if I achieve my goals uh, in that war and I'm literally about to start another war against the Decron here. I've added up all of the planets that I'm able to take off them and that amounts to 15 as well. So both of those would be 30 plants which will bring me to 89 plants which is a couple past the domination, current domination victory. Uh, planet amounts that I need to win the game. So yeah, we're really really close now and uh, In regards of this war, which I'm about to start uh, Sadly, I'm not able to completely wipe them out. They will have one planet left and they also have uh, one system uh, Ally which is over here somewhere there. I think it is uh, Which I can't wipe out, but that doesn't really matter. Uh, they are actually colonizing a the planet there, but uh, it's going to be finished within a couple of months. And I think even if I didn't take that and took uh, that one instead, that's the one which I'm not going to be taking in this war. It'd be like one of one, so I wouldn't be able to do it anyway. But I'm going to start this war now before I'm on the border of their territory, because if that is fully colonized, it'll probably go up a point and uh, yeah, cause issues. So let's confirm. Standing that by war. to commence offensive operations. Uh, the fleet, I believe, the main fleet is over there. It's 40k strong, and yet, uh, in comparison to myself, they are pathetic when it comes to fleet power, so shouldn't be any issue whatsoever. My fleet is returning over here. Well, at least uh, one of my fleets is. I've got two currently. It's about 70k strong. Also, some armies over there. In between videos, I did... Uh, Quite a bit of work on my economy and I finally got around to picking an ascension perk, the one which I'd been uh, thinking about for quite a while. I did once say that I wasn't maybe not going to take it but um, yeah I still didn't stand at this point in the game I think it's worthwhile. Uh, I do want to upgrade a certain amount of my robots. I, if I take that then it means I don't have to research the I think one or two remaining uh, machine points text that are left in the tech tree so I've gone and picked that up and uh, yeah I've redesigned some of my robots so these are now my finalized robots uh, I've actually redesigned all four of my different robots so the old Irobot agent has uh, that I believe make him a tiny bit cheaper the Bug science robot, uh, that's the old design, this is a new design, so it's uh, focused on science and a couple of uh, reductions to uh, energy and uh, product minerals, and also the build speed I've added on that. The harvester design I've decided to slightly change, so that's increased the build speed, which is kind of the key problem I have at the moment, I can't build them quickly enough. I did have that on. I yeah, still have the opinion that I think they need to add some more robot traits. There's not enough decent ones, frankly. And uh, the main robot of mine is a Sentinel. It's my uh, main robot race. Uh, that's going to be my uh, long-term uh, robot of that type. But I've created a Rapid Sentinel, which has uh, got an extra trait over the old, quicker version. And... Um, yeah, I might make those if I need them really quickly and then upgrade them with uh, science, basically. In the science department, I sacked one or two scientists. I noticed that there was a statecraft guy available, so I wanted him. Uh, I think I sacked uh, Particles one. 
and uh, yes, about it. And a biologist. There is actually a another biologist I can hire if I want one back of those. So that'll work out. And uh, I also had a quick look on the Stellaris wiki for the Mega Engineering Tech. Supposedly, if you have a maniacal scientist, it increases the likelihood of it turning up. So I've stuck that maniacal guide there and changed. Um, I think I put uh, my uh, resource scientist type on uh, one of the ships somewhere. Uh, that one. Materialist, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, so I think we're pretty much ready to uh, get going then and continue these two wars. Uh, I also, before I started, uh, spent 5,000 energy on getting that research bonus from one of the curators. I didn't actually have it. I don't know what that was. I was getting them confused, perhaps. But we've got that now. There is some information about the Leviathan uh, down here with one of the curators, but perhaps I'll wait on that before I check that out. Just continue on this war. Uh, in terms of... Uh, I haven't actually started on upgrading any of my robots and new designs. I should do that as well. Yeah, so I've worked on a ton of these building the odd building that needs to be done. Doing tiny bits of purging here and there. Uh, making a ton of robots, the newer ones I've added in a list. I've got to get uh, plunder my sectors because they're about to hit the caps pretty soon. Let's. Um, Check out my species then. Let's upgrade my old agents. Uh, let's click on that. Supply templates. Yeah, I've actually got trait points left on a lot of my machine designs. There's just nothing better to give them though than I've already given them. Okay, so that's not going to be too much. Let's supply the templates and I get a bit of a reduction there as well. Right, let's research that. Only a couple of months. Okay. Uh, right. Let's get going. Ships refitted. Okay, so I think that was a couple of science ships that. Uh, yeah. I had uh, refitted. Let's just research there. Let's just research there. Right. Where's my uh, number one fleet in the moment? Okay, they're coming in. Right, that's good. Right. Uh, if, yeah, if we have a look at this, it's about to get done. So, could have destroyed and resettled it maybe if I'd have been a bit quicker, but it's not going to matter too much. That, let's bring that up to there. I'll upgrade and then we can get out and start conquering. Okay. Construction complete. Right, station done. I think all of the hard work has basically been done now in this game. It's just a case of uh, finishing it up. Battle debris <laughs> secured. I'm uh, perhaps counting my chickens before they hatched, but uh, yeah, I'm pretty confident the fins are going to go pretty well now. Shouldn't be too System many issues. System reconnaissance completed. Uh, I was expecting it maybe to even go up to 200 years into the game, mm -hmm. at least before winning, and uh, maybe have the risk of the crises uh, wrecking fins. And uh, causing loads of problems, but at the moment it doesn't look as if that's going to happen. Anyone near? Okay. Oh, Decron mentioned declaration of war received. Battle stations online. Prepare for retaliatory disintegration. Okay. Uh, right. Next month I'll raid that. It's probably worthwhile. Special project complete. Right. New modifications have been done to uh, the agents. So there's zero of that type left now. If we modify the template, 
can actually delete that. Right. Okay. Next one. What shall I do? Let's do the uh, that type of harvester into the more modern. To be honest, that is actually better than that because uh, that only works when you're making the robots, and that will work always. But uh, yeah, I'm never going to resettle them, so I guess I'll make that my key harvester design. Um, well, let's uh, apply that template first on uh, to the newer harvester. Even though arguably I should do the resettlement one. Uh, right, if I can find it. That's the older one. Right. That's the newer one, isn't it? Okay, apply templates. It's a bit finicky that can Yeah. I'm often fearful of getting that wrong by mistaking and converting them into the wrong type. Uh right, so let's I need to if I'm gonna plunder one of my sectors, well I would get twenty one thousand minerals, twenty eight thousand is cap, and I get eleven thousand odd energy. I want to do that. But I need to uh, convert some energy to, or minerals to uh, energy, I think. So how much uh, energy is it? 11,000. Let's go to a trader. Don't think it matters which one, really. They're all 100 on relations. Let's trade for energy credits. Can't get any better deal with the empires, I think, sadly. Uh, let's just do... It was 20,000, wasn't it? Okay, that'll do. And let's plunder. Oh. Huh. Well, it doesn't hasn't changed colour for it hitting the cap, which I would expect. Yeah, but I think I should do this. Probably would do next month. Uh, so, let's do that. Yes. Some of these other ones might be hitting it soon as well, actually. So I've now got enough to actually uh, turn a place into a machine world. And I don't think there's an easy way to find out which are your biggest plants. I should do it in that order, really. But, um, yeah, I've uh, no real idea, to be honest, which one is... Uh, biggest worlds. Let's do... Well, there's actually biological stairs, so I shouldn't do that. Uh, I'll start to purge some of those as well, replace them. Yeah, let's do uh, this one then. Machine world. Okay. Right. Right, let's make some progress in this war again, finally. Construction complete. Right. I could be making ships, but I kind of want money at the moment more than anything, and that would reduce my maintenance if I make ships. So I got enough, frankly. Right, a bit worried about what they're up to. Hopefully, they don't have armies, but uh, fleet is coming back. That's done. Should be paying attention. Land armies. Ground forces are dropping on target. Science ship reports enemy contact. Okay, that's not good. Which one? Uh, right. Ground objective secured. Okay, good. Planet taken. So it's not a call. And both are there two in there. Yeah, there is. Okay, we need to get over 
here. Alright, orbit. I don't know if you click on that with the army if it just enters orbit or tries to invade, so I better do it manually. Construction complete. Right. Uh, I've noticed as well, I don't think the population icon is different to the building icon when you complete something. They definitely need to change that because, uh, yeah. You, at the moment, I would probably ignore the stuff being made here apart from the population ones. Right, the modification one just got uh, done. Let's upgrade that. Uh, is there an energy grid? Yes. Stick that there. Okay, let's upgrade another species. So, how long for that? 14 months? Um. Did I muck up on that actually? I think I did muck up on that. Uh, I meant to turn... those into that. Yeah. <laughs> so as I mentioned, it is finicky. Uh, right, so I'm going to take a minute out to figure this out. Make sure I get it right this time. Okay, I think I've got it right this time round. Uh, I've wasted several months of science by uh, messing up there. Yeah, definitely could be a bit clearer, frankly, that system. Uh, it doesn't help talking at the same time and thinking about things, to be honest, <laughs> when you're trying to figure that out. If I wasn't doing that, maybe I wouldn't have uh, made the mistake, but oh well. Uh, right, uh, let's check out number one fleet. I should get a message when uh, that fleet upgrades. Okay. Right. The constant calculator. We picked up a signal. It originates from the titanic metallic sphere we encountered earlier. Previously impervious to contact attempts, it now sends out a rhythmic pulse of radio waves pointed towards the black hole it orbits. What it's doing is beyond any of our staff. But this signal might have created an opening into the sphere for our scientists to exploit. Fascinating. So we got a special project, or we could just get influence because we don't have time for this. Arguably, I should just do that. At this point, I'm concentrating on the war. I guess I'll do that, but I'm not sure I'll ever get around to doing this project. Uh, let's. While we're talking about the sphere, I guess, uh, let's come to the curator and uh, ask a bit about it, though. To tell us the mysteries of the universe, tell us about the infinity machine. Ah uh, yes, the chromatic being from long ago. We have studied it for as long as our order has existed, as have several civilizations before us. This machine is beyond ancient, for all we know it has always been, and yet all it does is orbit that black hole. It's fascinating to us, but we understand if it is too much for you to grasp. What is it really? The infinity machine, as you so bluntly call it, is impervious to extraction. No information comes out of it. No hacker or engineer in the entire galaxy has been able to see through its shiny exterior to gain a glimpse of the knowledge it so obviously withholds from us. We are at a loss. We neither know what it is for, nor what it aims to do once it is done. Uh, so we could ask how to defeat it. Yet they know nothing about it. Uh, how would our fleet fare against it in battle? Yours is a mighty fleet, comparable to some of the greatest armadas recorded in the annals of curator order. Victory is certainly within your reach. Okay, so... May do something with that. At the moment, I'm thinking maybe not. Right. Uh, we've got an update on that. So, oh, more influence for money. I'm uh, happy, very happy to do that. Okay. 
system reconnaissance completed. Uh, right. Excellent. Mm -hmm. I think as well. Yeah, the price has come down a tiny bit on making an outpost there, so I'm actually going to do that. Um, I'm actually going to rival the guys I'm at war with as well as Slaus Cox. Probably should have done it before, I kind of realised that, but didn't. So, let's declare rivalry. That's not much, is it? Ah, what the hell. Confirm. It shows how weak they are now. So there's two rivals I've got. I guess I could rival them, but it's probably like 0.1, I guess. 0.5. What the hell? Right, that's all three rivals. Okay, uh, let's get back to here. Right, still on route. So I think my army is so strong that they could win even though I haven't got the defences down. That's what that's saying. Construction complete. Maybe I should wait until they go down before Ground I forces are dropping on target. Invade on Battle there. debris secured. Uh, right, they rival us back. And like that. So if it's just done there. Construction complete. Okay. Ground objective secured. Okay, excellent. Right, uh, that can get back out. Uh, let's survey here, here, here. Now, where are the fleets gone to? Are they within my territory? If they are, I can't see them, but I don't have. Well, actually, my sensor site's pretty good in my territory, so I don't know where they are. Uh, let's get back to here for the time being now. Uh, right. So, um. Yeah, they've got less fleet there, or split it up, than they had at about 50 odd before, I think. Uh, right, I've got those three in the list, I think, and then that's it for what I added uh, previously. I uh, yeah, just those three. Right, let's just get over to here. Okay, and is that upgrading slowly? So there's the new dragon armor's been put on these, basically. Construction complete. And I save a bit of uh, energy and minerals while I docked up. Uh, right. Mm -hmm. That should be now for the fetch colony. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I'll take. Come down here, take those, and then probably come down here, and then that little cluster. Right, so I'm about to hit uh, that cap. Let's trade for uh, what you call it, energy. So, right. right, that'll do. And let's do another machine. I'll do the other colony here. Oh, uh, actually, um, I'm making an outpost there. That will bring that in range, and then I'll terraform that next. Okay. Yeah, that's a better decision. I'm going to colonize that. Takes quite a while to terraform, though, sadly. Caps is nearly done. That's colonizable. That's got four years. That's longer. Anomaly found. Okay. Battle debris secured. Excellent. Let's go get some more. Uh, there's debris there, but uh, it's also a rather large fleet. So let's go and grab that one. Right. Okay. 
Construction complete. Construction complete. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ships refitted. Okay, is that my main f oh second fleet? Uh, yes. Okay. Give it a name, why not? Unify automatons. Okay, Decron attack fleet basically. Uh, right, so let's get this out then to here and the army that's in this system can come down there on route as well okay right fleeting special coming. project complete uh right so the harvesters have been upgraded and they should be the right ones this time round yes okay so let's delete that old template Okay, right, uh, which one next? Uh, let's upgrade, let's get this right, uh, let's apply that template to the sentinels, those ones, okay. It's going to be a bit more expensive. You know what? Actually, I'm going to complete a research first of all. Let's complete that. See if the Mega Engineering turns up. Alien Mural. Okay, that's a pretty frequent event. Uh, track a map. Right. Fleet action underway. Okay, which one is that? It's my uh, unified automaton fleet. Uh, let's call this something else as well. Enslave. Bio. Scum. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, right. Recon pass completed. Uh, okay, excellent. No losses. Looks like that's done. Uh, that, that means I can get my army in safely. Let's do so. Let's orbit. What was that? A survey in Dan. Right, it's got more this good. Right. Uh, that's long routes. Recon pass completed. Okay. Um, I think I probably should make another habitat just in case. Is it possible in this system? I think I might have run out of, uh, yeah, planets, <laughs> frankly. Um, if I do that, I would, oh, I can't do that anyway. Uh, right, let's find a different place to make planets then. Uh, so my other place I was making those was heaps, but that's not part of a sack that could cause issues if I were to do it there. Um, what about... Rear door system. Yeah, let's make a habitat there then. If I can find a constructor. Okay. Construction complete. Alright. Uh, secured 
for our colonists. Okay, I think that's something just finished being colonized. Fuldar Prime, okay. So I need to definitely work a little bit on that. So I'll take a brief minute out to uh, add a few things here.